Okay, a big setback to the Maran brothers and the DMK just ahead of the elections. The Madras High Court has rejected a plea by the Maran brothers to quash the charges framed against them by a trial court in the illegal telephone exchange case. In fact, we have with us uh, India Today's Lokpriya Vasudevan. Lokpriya, isn't this a double blow? Because last year also Madras High Court had rejected Dayanadi Maran and his brother Kalanidhi petition to cancel the charges against them. Well, definitely, yes. Uh, this is a big setback to the Maran brothers and the DNK ahead of elections. The Madras High Court rejects the plea by Maran brothers to quash charges trained against them by a trial court in the illegal telephone exchange case. The Madras High Court has directed the special CBI court to complete the trial in four months. Uh, remember, the charges are framed under sections 120B, criminal conspiracy, 409, criminal breach of trust and the Prevention of uh, Corruption Act. And uh, this is a case uh, that dates back to several years uh, where the CBI had alleged that uh, Diana Dumaran had misused his official position and got private telephone exchanges installed at his residence in Chennai. And these telephone lines were used for Sun Network business transaction. This was a main charge against uh, Diana Dumaran. And now he is being fielded as a central Chennai candidate uh, for uh, the DMK in the upcoming uh, Lok Sabha post. It will be interesting to see how the Maran brothers deal with this as in the run-up to the uh, Lok Sabha post okay. because the opposition will definitely be harping on this issue. All right, we're going to leave it at that. Thanks so much for joining us. Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share, and subscribe to India Today. Also, check out our other great videos from our channel. We know you would love to.